located along Walnut Street in Baraboo, Wisconsin. This 150-year-old historic landmark has gone through a lot. In its spicy heyday, the inn served as a tavern and a brothel, conveniently located across from the railway station, connecting this sleepy town to crime-infested Chicago. The Old Baraboo Inn was built in 1864, offering a convenient services to travelers arriving from the Windy City. Originally, it opened as a boarding house, a honky-tonk saloon, and even a brothel. Among the hundreds of souls that passed through these walls when alive, one of the most famous was Al Capone. Scarface used to hang out at the Old Baraboo Inn during the naughty Prohibition days. He enjoyed his visits so much, well, he just never left. Paranormal Evidence Review has confirmed this old fella still lurks in one of his favorite hole in the walls. In the first space, you have the front main tavern. Here, one senses the rugged and determined personalities of the cowboy who had a bit too much to drink. Then there's the back tavern, the second distinctive area of haunts that offers a more hidden and protective aura. Are these the spirits that protected the tavern's naughtiness? The third space is the brothel, which is located on the second floor. The original entrance to this hospitality triple X suite was once found in back of the main bar via a hidden stairwell. Today, it is accessed from the outside of the pub through its own private entrance. Be assured, this detour has not confused the gals and happy fellas that are still up there. There is a combined sexual tension felt, especially in one of the rooms. The fourth chamber of haunts is the basement. Yes, the dreaded basement. This space is generally closed off to guests, for it can be quite unsettling. Some call the entity there pure nastiness. Come with as we investigate the old Baraboo Inn. What is up, Wisco fam? Welcome back to another haunted adventure. My name is Sugar. Baja. And we are Go Get Em Paranormal Team. Today we are in Baraboo, Wisconsin at the old Baraboo Inn. This place, I don't know, I'm ready for this one. The history on this thing is insane, just like you saw the stories, the accounts people have said. But you know what we do best? We come to find out if places are really haunted. So, I guess, wish us luck, and let's hope that it is. Let's go get it. this with me what are we going to see does it want us to go back downstairs i bet you it does so the spirit talker just said to go left that's kind of funny because left is the basement you know from where we were standing mm -hmm. right. and then we're not allowed to go down there alone we even had to sign a waiver to come here so we're not we will we would go down there if we could but we're not gonna if we got follow the rules <laughs> Rules are made I'm really here. to be broken. You're really here? Who's really here? Mary, is that you? I think it's just staying right on there, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> just staying on. I wonder if it's picking up something. Prisoner. Yeah. You're a prisoner. Are you a prisoner here? You stuck here? 
Are you happy here or do you want to leave? What? It's a REM pod, right? Yeah, it's a REM pod. Okay. Oh, something's by the REM pod. Can you touch that device again? I see you. Can you make it go off again? It looks like you're trying to kick it. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing? Are you playing? Go ahead and touch it. 1990s. 1990s. Did you hang out here in the 1990s? You kind of look like you're dancing. You having a good time? On the bar? I touched the REM pod. Can you touch... That device again, if you touch it, it lights up with little colors, it'll make noises. That's a good way to communicate with us. Let's see if it'll stay there. Is it still there? Yeah. Here's another device that you can speak into. Still there? Damn it. Oh, let's try and not scare it. Dang it. Okay. Ghost. Ghost. Yeah. I was kind of hoping they'd come back. I was enjoying their dance moves and. Darn it. Oh. Oh, we've got two of them. Where are they at? Mm. By the no. pool. Can you touch the device right there on the table with the red light? I see you came back. You're floating. It's gone now. Yeah. Say so your name at the top of the stairs, say so you're coming down. Okay. BC, you know me, I'm coming down. My name is Sugar. My name is Faja. You guys know it's me. If there are any spirits here, first of all, thank you for letting us come and visit you today. We do not mean any harm or any disrespect. We just want to get to know who you are, maybe get your name. We have a couple devices that you can speak through. We would love to conversate with you. And you can also show yourself on that device. Do you feel the energy change? Not yet. I just did. It's, a, it's light. It's not anything. You don't feel that? A little bit. It's not, mm. it's not the worst I've felt. Thank you for sure. Oh, no. Yeah. It's, it's pretty much good. But this is a tone room where the Tony used to go across the street to the brewery. And uh, I built a dry storage room over this. Just to stop them, and they just come right through here. We got the ghost cam on. Did you see uh, shadow figures walk through here and go right down the hall all the time? We got one ghost cam right there. Yeah, we're down here. That's your interrogation room where people used to tie to a chair and just beat to hell. A couple people died in there. Thank you for touching my arm. I appreciate it. It was a very nice touch. Thank you. Mm -hmm. But it was very, very soft and subtle. Grave. Grave. Oh, oh he just gone. disappeared. Yeah, probably because I had to walk in front of you. There is many bodies buried yeah. down here. Oh, yeah, yeah. I heard there are a lot of bodies buried down here. Does anybody else want to say hello? Maybe give us your name? This is 
where all the or most of the abortions happen, uh, forced abortions. There's a dirt floor. I'm sure they just shovel the stuff in the dirt. Sure. Leave a REM pod right there, guys. I know. I can feel it. Yeah. The, the aluminum can shoot's actually in the next room. Oh. Interesting. Who threw a loan can over here? Whoa, 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 whoa. Who threw a loan can over here? Victoria. Guess who threw it? You know who that is? She answered that really quick. Yeah. I want to bring some people over there. We're coming over. Thanks. Hey, <laughs> thanks for letting us come to come come visit you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. you feel energy change when you walk through the store. The camera literally just shut off. Like usual. You know how it rolls. Our stuff never stays on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, you got yep, yep, right here. Yep. They've got one right here. Yep. Hi, what is your name? On his knees. PC, that's the same one before. Can you wave to me if you can see me? Oh, oh he's back, he's back. Another one. There's two of you. Yeah. Oh, one's waving. Are you, you're Patricia back there? Hi, Patricia. Nice to meet you. Who's down here on the floor? Thank you for showing yourself. I really appreciate yes, thank it. Thank you. one that's hanging back here. Ooh, who's Got back in here? Man. Who's back in there? Right there, yep. What's right. that other room over there? Oh, that just goes back around to the stairs. Join us. We're going to join you. We're joining you right now. We're waiting, girlfriend. <laughs> Somebody playing with our REM pod? I was just going to say. You go right ahead. We bring toys along. Sure. I want you to have fun. Yeah. yeah. It was, there was nothing there. Nothing there. Yeah, it's just like one. Well, they don't want to show themselves on there. They don't have to. All right. This, one, this is the next room here. <laughs> this one's the one that. Al Capone's hangout was down here. He used to hang out in his gang in the in the bottom of the bar usually. He had three escapes. He had an escape route out to the the doors went out to the parking lot. He had an escape route through the tunnel to the brewery and he had an escape route up to the bar. Cool. Did you just hear that? Yeah, I just did. Steps. A thump, yeah. thump. Steps, 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 steps. Yeah. I missed there's it. There? There's no, no there's nobody up there. there. The I missed it. I was too but engrossed yeah. in what he was saying. Sorry. Yeah. I was really into what he was saying. So was I. But then I heard it. You might, yeah, I bet you probably picked Paul. up on that. Paul. You're in the hall upstairs? Maybe they think it's the hall. I'm not even in that room and I can already. <laughs> I know, I know. It just pours on it. It doesn't force through the door. Hello. Got a couple new friends. I'm Mike. It's great to meet you. My name's Sugar. Okay, get nice to meet you. My name's... Hi, This is the execution pole. Execution pole. Put up against the pole, just whap. Pull bolts of head height and bolts of stomach height. That's pretty neat. Uh, that's blood bleeding through the pole yet. I painted, painted, painted that pole. Just keep bleeding through it, just keep up fine. Everett. Everett. That's a lot of names. Have you Everett, heard any of these yeah, names yet? No, no, that's a new one, actually. Isn't it? Everett? We, we've heard that before. Everett? Yeah. I haven't heard that one. It's an old name. We had, uh, we had this camera like that here, and we were talking about, uh, I had somebody tied to the pole. You could see the, you could see the stick figure tied yeah. to the pole. <coughs> and it was looked like it was struggling a little bit, and then all of a sudden it held really still, and then it, the next thing you know, it was on the floor right here laying, you know, like mm. it died right yeah. there. And uh, it could be buried Vortex. right there, too. Vortex. That's interesting. Right Right. Yes. Yeah, I, I, I'm buried right over here. That's interesting. It's not his history, but 
Mm-hmm. Well, I don't know who the jokester is who so oh, yeah. keeps shutting off my phone, but it, I mean, it's okay. I don't know who the jokester is. Keep shutting it off. Well, that's fine. It is a toy, so you can have fun with it. Jokester standing right behind you. Oh, it's gone now. It's behind me? It was. It just left. Faja said that the, uh, we had a stick figure right behind me. Maybe that was the, uh, jokester. No, no. That's okay. I'm a jokester, too. So it's fine. Yeah. Exactly where we're here tonight. web effect. Hardcore right here. And I know it was because, did you get it? And I know it was because he already walked through it. <laughs> that wasn't funny. We're enjoying this. <laughs> <laughs> We're enjoying this. We are too. Thank yeah, you. I stuck my camera on that. I stuck my camera around like that. I was going to take a picture and they shut my camera off. <laughs> it said we we're enjoying this. That's what it just said. So yeah. clearly it's having fun. That's fine with me. It's good. It's, it's actually a really nice breath of fresh air compared to demons. Thank you. Yeah, we don't have any Appreciate it. Here. Yeah, you should come with us sometime. 1867 leather bound Bible in here. Old tongues and testaments. You want to put your hand in it when you clean it, then you're welcome to. If you what? Old tongues and testaments. You want to put your hand in it, you're welcome to. Anything you say. We're loaded with holy water Oof. and prayer. It's nice to meet everybody. If you want to later, you can join us upstairs in the brothel. We'd love to have you guys come visit. We'll be up there for quite a while. Yeah, okay. Yeah, my phone's actually yeah, beating there. like a heartbeat Lucy. right now. Lucy. Oh, wasn't that her name? Is that you, Lucy? We can see you. Can you wave if that's you? Damn you, why she got her windows wide open. It's working? I'm not kidding. No. You, you mean the thought of it? No. I'm not sure like <laughs> Lucy, can you wave at me if that's you? I mean, I'm just saying. Was, you know Lucy? Was Lucy a woman of the night? Was that, wasn't that the zone that got tied up down here? Well, it was very interesting if you watched what she did when we first saw her. It was a very provocative yeah. pose, actually. Yep. You're standing right on your camera. See me. There. I do see you. I sure do. Now, I will say this, guys. It's really cool to be down here and actually see a part of history. It's, it's been here a long time, you know. And a lot of people actually uh, were murdered down here. and um, Damage. Damage. And abortions and uh, game rapes and Al Capone was down here so you all know how the mob works um, it's very interesting we'd love to get into that door they don't go in that room so they won't let us in that door but you know we would go in there likely likely yeah I know I honestly like I feel stuff down here, but it's it's not bad. No, it's I'm not. I'm I'm like it's if if he's not yeah, if not bad, he's not being bad right now. You know what I mean? However he's, he's never that bad anyway. Yeah, I mean I just don't you know, like I, I feel uneasiness. There's definitely uneasy, but locked. Locked. Are you locked down here? That that makes sense. Or are you talking about the door we were talking about being locked? Be fearful. I am actually not going to be fearful. But thank you for the warning. I'm Fasha excited to be here. I am. I'm excited for the brothel. Yes. Sometimes I think our fate hinders us in this location. Did you notice that? They get very quiet around us. Mm-hmm. We need more demon hunters. We're still here. We're still here? Well, where are you? Can you give me directions? Can you make a noise? Lead me to where you are, and I will follow. Bullet holes, guys. One more time here. Sweet bullet holes. 
Ancient spirit. Ancient spirit. That's interesting. Yeah. Are there any uh, Native American spirits here at all? We'd love to talk to you too. It came on here when I was Joan when I was talking and I said it's locked. Thank you for letting us. I did not kick that can. Gloria. No, you would have heard it if we kicked it. I never touched it. I just moved two feet. Hmm? Oh, you got yep, yep, right here, yep. They've got one right here. I never touched it. I never kicked it. You would have heard it if I kicked it. I didn't touch. I forgot all about that can actually (laughs) until he said something. Actually, it was over here. I noticed it was missing. I thought maybe you picked it up. I did pick it up. Well, somebody likes soda. I moved it. Yeah, somebody moved it. You sure you didn't kick it? I swear to God, you would have heard it. I swear to God, God is my witness. I didn't hear it move at all. Yes. So, That's, whatever spirit picked I, it up. I was the last one in there, and I know damn well I didn't touch it. I heard there are some child spirits here. One of you is named Griffin. I have a recorder here that you can speak into. If you want to say your name or say hello. I'm just going to set this right here on the rocking so there's a closet here, and apparently we're supposed to ask for permission to go into the closet. I'm not sure why they would say that. Do we have to ask permission to go into the closet? You want to open the closet, Pasha? Jeez, watch out. Careful. Ask for permission. I don't know what's supposed Opening to be. Open the closet. Anybody in there? Griffin, are you in there? That's what they said your name was. Well, if anybody wants to, uh, you know, shut this door, you can. I'll leave it open a little bit. And that device is right there. If you want to talk into that, you can step in front of this device. If you want to take a picture, feel free. We got a REM pod right there too, guys. Yes, sir, it's your tabby. Is it knocking? What was that? I don't know. Okay. Do me a favor. Walk where you were. Walk back through there. sit down and do the necrophonic guys we're gonna spend the night here is that okay <laughs> Is your name 
Griffin? We just want to talk to the little kid right now. You. What? No. Oh, you can see him there. All right, guys. So we did not have the can on, and we legit, legit, just heard him all. It wasn't a regular moan. It was a sex moan. Mm -hmm. Why was I not recording? I mean, that was like... Really obvious. Is there anybody, uh, oops, sorry. Are there any spirits in here maybe uh, making love? I guess it was loud, but it was faint. Big fan. Somebody having an affair here? So it's a fair. <laughs> Who had an affair here? We're not having an affair. Yeah. My name is Sugar. I'm Faja. That's my Faja. I just call him Faja, but he's my dad. <clears throat> but we are definitely not having an affair. Somebody here want to have an affair? Billy. 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 Okay, Billy. I mean, I don't really like boys like that, but Faja doesn't like boys like that either. You might have to, you know, talk to one of the other ladies that work here. Talk to Joyce. There you go. I mean, I want to know how much I have to pay to be with one of the dad. ladies. Oh, it's just a dad. Dad. That is my dad. But how much would it cost? To have one of the beautiful ladies of the night here spend a little one-on-one -on -one time with my dad. How much would that cost? Does anybody think he's cute? Find him attractive? We have money. He's a pretty good looking guy. He is for sale. Sure. Terrible. Terrible. What's terrible? What's terrible? Am I being terrible? Maybe. I'm trying to sell my dad. So. Oh. Oh. What does it cost? How much? He's got money. Laying down the money for you, ladies. What I think is a good idea. We'll take a break and go downstairs. We'll see if these are laying on the bed still when we come back. Okay. We'll just leave the camera running though. Yeah, nobody's up here. You know, we could, I mean, you don't have to leave the spirit talker going if you don't want. I'm enjoying this. <laughs> I'm enjoying this instead. I'm enjoying this too. We're gonna, we're gonna be right back and uh, we're gonna go smoke a cigar. Yes. You know, and uh, you let us know if this is enough money to be with my dad for a few hours. And we'll be back. Yes. Okay. You let me know. Don't steal the money, though. Because we can't pay you if you steal the money. So, don't go stealing it. Okay? Now, what? What's up? The money isn't moved. Is that camera still recording? I didn't even look. Understand. 
Yep. What we're gonna do, guys, we're gonna put Faja on the bed. And see if one of the ladies of the night maybe will come join him. Um, there's something on the bed already. Well, on the wall, anyway. Looking over the bed, looks like it's looking at the REM pod. Hmm. Good morning. Oh. Would you come join me? Oh, who's gonna, who's gonna meet Faja over there? Good morning. Come get it. Yeah. Not quite sure when the brothel was going on, but I would think uh, $50 back then was a lot of money. Lots of money. <laughs> Are there any spirits that want to come? I mean, Fajal's got $50. $50. I'm not going to hurt my feelings. Anybody that wants to come and say hello to Fajal, you just I swear I'm not looking. You go right ahead, and you, uh... Don't touch me. Ooh. Faja, sounds sexy. Say something. You know, yeah. I don't know. Are there any beautiful ladies that want to... What? I'll get you in another room. Maybe they're coming. You still hear it? I don't know, he's pretty handsome. Come on, ladies. Take the bait. You might want to flaunt that money a little bit more. Ladies. Yeah. Go. Come get it. I mean, we're expecting some special treatment for this kind of money. I wonder how much money that would have been back then. No, no. It had to have been a lot. This place was open, what, 1894? Something like that. I mean, back then, an acre was like a dollar. You know, that's 50 oh, bucks. Okay. That would be, yeah. You could buy a town. I don't really understand this. It's like, nobody wants. Sell Fasha with his own money. I don't know what we gotta do here. Maybe he has to strip. Look at him. Sister. Sister. Hmm. I mean, he's fine with two at a time. <laughs> you and your sister. <laughs> Bring your sister along. We need more money then? You or might. Buy one, get one free. It could be buy one, get one. Look at Fasha's getting sleepy over there. Sarah, can you make a noise for us? Maybe knock on something? Or Griffin? Any of the kids that are here? Oh. Did they? Sarah, did you just touch me? Like. Ooh. It was a soft touch. <laughs> oh, she like you. She like you, Fasha. Can you, you touch me again? Better be careful. I don't know about you, but your shoe just scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I was like, who's standing right there? <sighs> yeah. Where in the hell did the moan come from? Well, it sounded like it was back here. Yeah. Sarah, a while ago we heard a moan come out of this room. Was that you? Leave this place. 
Hmm. No. We're going to spend the night. Maybe they're maybe they're tired of people coming here. It's a possibility. I mean, you have to think that even in spirit, eventually, I would assume people would get irritated. A spirit would get irritated if people are constantly coming here um, to do investigations. I, I would, I guess, I would assume that they probably aren't getting any rest though. So. All right, guys, this is the first time that the void's been done at the Baraboo Inn. Any type of blind spirit box, anything. It's never been done here before, so this is the first. So I'm really excited to bring our little specialty that we like to do here at the Baraboo Inn. So those of you that are new, I will be blindfolded. And I have my beats on right now. I got the headphones plugged up to the necrophonic. And we have the actual walkie-talkie that Faj is going to speak into. The spirits are going to answer the questions. And I'm going to say what I hear and hear. But I'm not going to be able to hear what he's saying. Just to let you know that's how we do it. So I'm all alone right now. A little creepy. Baja, can you hear me? Yes. Okay, go. How many spirits are here with us tonight? Us. Small kids, so be. Are there any children spirits here? The pillow. Ask. Go. Spirits. Is Al Capone with, with us tonight? sitting here and it went like this <laughs> like from right to the floor I was like uh okay <laughs> um, I guess I'm gonna try to put it here I don't know okay I'm gonna start again I don't know what you were asking sorry whenever you're ready See? Are there any spirits here that used to work here? How many spirits are here? Can you touch my daughter? You can touch her, but you cannot hurt her. What's your favorite color? Purple. Yellow. 
is there anything evil here? Can you say your name of any spirits right here? Is there any male spirit here? How many ladies worked in this house? Okay, Wisco fam. So it is the next morning. We are about to leave. We uh, did our investigation. Uh, we slept there for about three hours, taped ourselves sleeping. We offered to pay the prostitute money. Gonna happen. Uh, happen. We heard one moan. No. Unless we got anything else on the footage. I don't know, guys. I don't want to be disrespectful, but I just feel like it was another Stanley. I don't really have much to say, guys, because I didn't experience anything myself. Uh, if, if we got EVPs, awesome. I haven't gone over the footage yet. Uh, like I said, we heard a moan. Oh, that's about it. Didn't really feel anything. I didn't get, I didn't feel any like touches really or. I felt one downstairs. And the one in bed. And the one in bed. Those are the only touches that we felt. Or that you felt. Uh, I don't know, guys. I'm just going to be uh, as respectful as possible. So, on to the next one. Yes.